What's up, guys? Welcome to my YouTube channel. And in this quick episode, or quick video, I should say, I'm gonna show you how to make this uh, balaclava, AKA ski mask, AKA the poo shiesty, back in blood. You know what I'm saying? You see how it is. In this video, I'm gonna show you how I did it step by step, how I recreated it using some scuba knit fabric. Um, I used a rotary cutter as well. My bad, let me, <laughs> probably can't even hear me. So um, I grabbed scuba knit and um, I grabbed, I, I have a rotary cutter, but you don't need that. You can use scissors or uh, anything to really cut fabric with. And then um, I sewed it on my little juki right here, but you can use any kind of home sewing machine. I'm gonna try to make more videos and maybe just tell me in the comments and um, below and let me know if you wanna see like my whole setup, what machines I use uh, or any kind of other content that you guys wanna want me to record and make. Um, definitely try, again, this is a real new YouTube page. So if you guys can like, subscribe and follow me and just comment below and tell me what you guys like about this video or what I should add to the video or to the channel, it'll definitely appreciate and help me grow. Um, but yeah, without any other ado, let's go right into it. Bitch! Step one, cutting pattern. So you know I'm over here doing my thug dizzle, cutting that shit smooth as hell. Step two, lay your patterns out. And then you got the side panels, you should have two of those. Then you have your mask pattern. Then you have one on the fold. Then you have your center panel, that's for the crown, top of your head. Then you're gonna have the mask binding, that's to clean it up nice. Then the crown binding. And last but not least, your hem binding. Step three, start sewing the mask with the binding. So you go straight down the line right here. And then it should be like this, and you're just gonna press your seams. And this is what it should look like. Now, what we're gonna do, step five, is take the side panels and connect it to the crown panel, or the center panel, I should say. So again, just match up your notches, put them place face to face, and then you're gonna sew a straight line. Make sure that the bottom is facing the top piece right there. And then you're gonna fold it over right there, I see. And then you're gonna get the other one and repeat the process. Now you're gonna get the binding for the crown and you're gonna do it right there so it keep it clean, clean, don't look at raw edges, you feel me? And so right there. After you're doing done that, now you're gonna press up, make it clean, 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 clean. You know what I mean? It's pressed. You bust them seeds open. Now I'm just top positioning right there on the crown binding. And now we're gonna put the mask onto the center panel. And now we're gonna press real quick. Now take, you're gonna take the side panel and match up to the mask right there so it stays connected. Sew it up some more, you see me doing my thug dizzle. Now this is what it should look like. Just going back, top stitching everything to make it look clean and fresh, you know. I like to have it nice, nice, nice. You know what I mean, look at me do my thing. Shout out to the design on my shirt, Dipser. Just go back in again. Step nine, doing the hem band. And this is pretty much the final step to clean it up. This is the bottom of the mask. Yeah, it's looking, it's looking clean, clean, man. Check me out, dog. Ripping all the extra seams, making sure everything is nice. Going back again, just finishing it all up. Here we go, Yakati. Damn, it's pretty long. So, this is the final look. This is what it, how it comes out, you know what I mean? And then you're done pretty much. You feel me?
Yo, guys, I hope you liked the video again. Comment, like, and subscribe if you want to see any more content like this. Um, help your boy out. Follow me. I'm trying to grow. Watch me grow. Um, I'm going to try to post more videos um, on how to's, how to build, how I made the studio that you see right here. Um, and yeah, man. And if you want to shop and get you one of these, definitely go onto my website, for, uh, smoothcats401.com. Shop today. You can get yourself a balacava, or I call these smooth ski mask. Get you a crew neck. And, you know, check me out. Follow me on social media platforms. I'm on Facebook. I'm on Instagram. You can look me up, Jason Soul Smooth. Uh, follow the brand page, Smoothcast 401. And let's grow together, man. I'm trying to make a community, man. So holla at me. Peace.